Okay, this is Dragon of Eternity, and welcome back to Pokemon Legends Arceus. In the last video, I started going through the long list of requests that I have. So I was able to set up a couple of base camps as a result of it. I got a few good items to sell and use on my Pokemon. And you've lost your sister again, haven't you? Uh-huh. And in this video... We'll be continuing going through that long list. Every time I'm in trouble, you turn up just like clockwork. That's right, Wanda's missing again. Please help me find my lost sister. Coronet Highlands. Ursaluna. Okie dokie. 69. Nice. Alright, any of us down here? Okay. And then there's... A crap done to pick up from the blackboard, but I feel like those are kind of event items, so event ones. Ah, if it isn't one of our beloved customers, might I trouble you for help with a little survey work in my family we passed down. Tales of some ancestor that lived in the village around the avalanche slopes, but I've never been able to find any hint of such a settlement ever existing. I'm beginning to doubt the tales are true, but anyone wants to know, uh, but everyone wants to know about where they came from, don't they? So help me out. See if you find any evidence people ever lived around the avalanche slopes. Well, I found that cave painting. Maybe that's it? Hmm. And then over here is one, two, three, four, five, six. I got six requests. On top of the amount that I have right now. Okay. Okie dokie. Alright, it's time I go down the list then. Or at least as close to the list as I can. Right. Show Kichi the completed Pokedex entry for Cherim. I've done this. I need to show it to him. Over there. Okie dokie. So let's get the first one out of the way. I swear, Cherim are really hard to come by. I found a Cherubi once and I ended up leveling Nat into a Cherim, and I had to use it in battle a bunch of times in order to complete the Pokedex. And that was really annoying. Finish, le finish Cherim's Pokedex entry, have you? Let me have a look. Wow, we sure went into detail. Uh huh, uh huh, I see. So it changes its form when the sun's hidden. Guess I didn't see it evolve, I just saw that change in action. I see now why it helps to have you Survey Corps folks working at researching Pokemon. Guess I'd better get back to my own work. Food's on the tables, just another way to repay you. Ha! Alright. Lovely. So next on the list of long requests. I'm still doing that one. Find a... Pokemon of the elegant tail that quir that curls like a spring. I feel like I have that. I feel like that might be Burmy. If not, then I still don't know where Spoink is. I don't suppose it's Burmy. Real elegant tail. Hmm. Curls up like a spring. No. What would it be? Huh. I have no idea. Huh. I'm really tempted to just look up a guide for this because I don't know what it is. I really don't know. I don't suppose it's Blissey, is it? Wait a minute. It couldn't be Clefairy, could it? There was a hope. 
It was definitely a hope. I'm going to show you every single bloody Pokemon I have. It has to be one of them. Like a tongue. No. Hmm. Pachirisu? No. Elegant. I don't know what it would be then. I feel like I've gone through every single list of Pokemon I have. I don't know which one has a Blaze Springtail. Except for Blaze Spoink. But I don't know if you could say that's elegant. It's going to be the cat, isn't it? Oh my god, it is. It's its pre-evolution. It's glad me out. Oh my... Really? Really? Why can't I find this bloody cat? Um... Hmm... i will be one around here somewhere. On that one. No, nope, there we go. Ay, ay, ay. Yes, this is it. It's just as I remember the elegant sway of its tail. That charming spiral shape and the enchanting way it bobs about like a leaf in the wind. Simply remarkable. <coughs> Meow. Oh, it's all me. I was adorable as hell. Have you got an attach to me there, kitty? Oh, the dilemma. Pokemon are scary, but maybe this little and I will get along just... Ah, the dog thing scratched me! That's cats for you. Rah. I guess I got a little carried away there. Thanks for, slow thanks for showing me your Glamio anyway. It still at least was a joy to see. One day when I find a Pokemon with the perfect tail for me, I'd like to become fast friends with it, just like you and your partner Pokemon. Alright. So I didn't have to find a bloody spoink. Good to know. Good to know. Doing that one. Speak about the request. Artillery. I believe I have that. I hope I have that. I really hope I have that. <laughs> I wish I could go on word here in the village. And again, I could have just fast traveled. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Uh huh. Here's the Pokedex entry about artillery. Oh my, so that's how it is. Wait, hold on. Are you quite sure? Good as the thing that Remoraid evolves into artillery despite them looking nothing alike. But more importantly, it seems Octillery isn't poisonous, so its ink must be safe to eat after all. Oh, I can't wait to gather us some ink and try creating lots of innovative new recipes. Once my new pickles are well and truly perfected, pop by for a taste, won't you, dear? Black Lemonade! God, that episode of Spongebob is freaky. Why did it turn the new seasons for Spongebob into Looney Tunes? I don't get that. Right, Machoke, I believe I have that. So... It's not in the bloody village. Okie dokie. It's all the way over here. Yeah, I think I've completed Machoke. I hope I have. Where am I going? All the way over there. Okie dokie. It's a shame about the render distance. Yeah. Yeah. It's a great game, it's just... It does have its underlying issues. Hello. Did you complete Machoke's Pokedex entry? Please show me. So it likes grain, huh? And it certainly has a sturdy, powerful body. It would be the perfect addition to the construction core. 
What are you doing? I could just give you one. Thanks to you, I was able to catch a macho. I guess I owe the survey call on. It seems to really enjoy the grain cake I threw at it. I promised we'd feed it lots of grain dishes. And that seems to be enough for it to help us. Macho. Only guy must sell. You know, the recent exploits of the Survey Corps are what inspired me to get from to get help from Pokemon in the first place. Keep up the good work, you hear? I don't suppose you can make a base camp around here? That'd be lovely. No? Shit. Alright. What's next on the long to-do list? Doing that one. Request, request, mischievous. Alright, so back home. Teleporting home. Return to village. It's kind of spooky about the music. There we go. Wait, are you a new... Oh my god, you are a new quest. Just when I thought I was done, they pulled me back in. Was black lemonade not enough for you? About your request, Mr. Drevis. You know, people are afraid of Mr. Drevis because of how it apparently wails at night. But getting a good look at it really gives me some fresh perspective. Look how it billows and sways and flows. Wait, that's it. That's what I'll do. Well, I just came up with some charming hairstyles and an enchanting new palette of colours, all thanks to you and Mr. Drevis. Come by any time and try out my new ideas for yourself. Okay. And a new request. No, that's not right either. Hmm, it needs a little something extra special something. Hmm, but what? Oh, nice timing as always. I could use your help again, coming with new hairstyles. Inspiration from a different Pokemon like Curlia. Don't I already have that? I hope I do. I could study a Curlia. Good news, I think I caught one. I hope I caught one. I did caught one. Oh, I did catch one. Lovely. You know, they say Curly, I just loves to dance. I kind of get it, that feeling when your hair sways around you like you're dancing. While you're dancing, it's the best. Actually, yeah, that's the sort of hairstyle I want to go for. Uh-oh. And how to gather up the hair the right way. And where it should be let down. Hmm. I've got it, that's what I'll do. I owe you one, thanks to you and Curly, new hairstyles, new colours. Lovely. Do you have another one? No. Alright, let's take a look at the different hairstyles. I'm curious. Give yourself a seat. Alright, what we got? <coughs> no. No. Kinda cute. No. 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 Hell no. 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 Tempting, but no. Alright. Well, that was a waste of 500. <laughs> yeah, well. At least I gotta check the styles. Uh -huh. Hat! Give me the warm hat! Drop by again any time, I'll keep polishing my skills. Alright, what's your new request? I've come up with the perfect pistol... <laughs> pistol? Pickle recipe! Thanks to Geodude. Aren't you curious? You bet I am. Tell you what, my dear, help me gather the ingredients and I'll teach you the recipe. Two chunks of crunchy salt, plump beans, and king's leaf. Alright, so what was that again? <laughs> I've instantly forgotten. Uh, rock salt, plump beans, king's leaf. If I remember, I need uh, king's leaf for... Not king's leaf, I need rock salt out for something else. 
plump beans, and where's the rock salt? Where's the rock salt? There's rock salt. Okay. I think I need that for another quest. Right, I've got the thing. I hope. Uh huh. Let's get let's get pickling. How are you going to do that with a leaf and a bean? I have no idea. Lovely. I already had the sand radishes I need. So let's get pickling. Whoa. Now for the final step, we need to place Geodude on top of it and it's done. What in the world? Graf. Gosh, Geodude changed shape. Is that the evolution business I've heard people talk about? And what about the pickles? Oh my, this is twice as good as I... I uh, this is twice as good as I expected. I'll call it the twice spice radish. It truly is the perfect pickle dish. Why, with the help of Pokemon, there's no limits to what a cook can accomplish. Thank you so much for helping me out. Are you going to become a golem? Yeah, you're just chilling around here. Alright, so I needed sand radish. Sand radish. And with that, I should be able to complete another quest here. Which is... Uh, not you, not you, not you. I could do that. You. How about before I do that? What am I looking for? All the way up here. Ghosts. I can turn this in real quick. Right, I've completed Ghastly's Pokedex entry. Time to show the scary dad some ghosts. Oh, gathered a lot of data on Ghastly, have you? Let's see now. So it's all recorded in this Pokedex of yours. All right, then. Mushrooms, eh? Well, I'll be. It says here that Ghastly likes to eat mushrooms of all things. Not that that's a bad thing, mind. It's just a lot more tame than I was expecting. And here I was thinking that ghosts love nothing more than a snack on unsuspecting humans. You know, it's funny. I'm actually rather partial to a nice mushroom stew myself. Maybe Ghastly aren't so... Ghastly after all. Hey, Dad, what you doing there? Back! Come on, Dad! You talking about work again? Don't forget, you gotta take a day off tomorrow. You promise you take me to see the ghosties at Prairie Beach, remember? Of course your old dad remembers, kiddo, and I never let work get in the way of a ghost hunt. I'm really looking forward to it. Yay, I'm going to catch a ghosty and show it to all my friends. Bye! Oh no, I gave him Pokeballs, didn't I? You know, he was just putting on a brave face because you were here. Anyway, I owe you one, kid. I get the feeling my boy will be just fine tomorrow. And a linking cord. Huh. Okay, no new quest yet. Lovely, so I need to give uh, the grumpy old guy downstairs some rock salt. And then that should open up some new wares in the shop. I'm still not touching those requests with barge pole yet. Hello. Uh-huh, survey core, Lord the Isles. Negotiating. Oh, am I going to have to negotiate after every single lord? Get so stubborn over selling the shopkeeper a few things. Maybe I'll tell you if you bring me three chunks of rock salt. Alright. But what I asked for already? No less than I expect of you. I wish I could persuade you to join my core. Now then. Rock salt. Or crunchy salt. Ah, crunchy salt. The coronet highlands finest feature. If you see it in the wild, don't pass it over as if it were just of a rock. This translucent mineral is great for making a potent Pokemon lore. You've got to break it up with a hammer, then get the chunks in the mortar and crunch them right up. Grind them into a powder, mix that powder with another ingredient and pack the mix together. And you'll get a crunchy cake that the Pokemon will love to munch on. Well, I can't send you back to try a failure, since you so kindly brought me the crunchy salt. Tell them I'll set up some new wares. You want to know what happened between me and Joy? Well, that well made off with my dearest treasure. I'll never let him live it down. Dearest treasure. Uh oh. I think I know what this is going to be. If an old episode of Disney's Aladdin has taught me anything, <laughs> 
it may not be an actual object. Well, I told me... Took a treasure, did I? That's one way to put it. But the story's not so simple. Please believe me for now. Glad it's nothing you ought to worry about. Given what a fine customer you are, I imagine I'll end up giving you the full story at some point. Excellent items. Oh, lovely. So I imagine now that I've done that... Nothing yet. Okay. I thought it'd be something new from you. Maybe I'm not that far in the game yet. Or maybe it's on the bulletin board. Hmm. Why do I keep skipping through menus? Alright, where am I going? What am I doing? Wisps. Still doing that. Floro. Alomus. Solve the mystery of the sea's legend. I would love to have some bloody info about this. Right on Ursa Luna for wonder. Search for traces of a village in the avalanche slopes. Oh, I think I understand what's happening here. I'm going to have to dig something up for first Luna. And there's no new other ones to pick up. Okay. What do you do with those ones in the Highlands? Not, not the Highlands. Yes, the Highlands. Ones in the Highlands, ones in the... Oh, there we go. Speak of the... I knew there's a quest from you. Never. Never you whelp. Oh dear customer, I'm sorry you had to see that. I asked Hatao to supply me, supply me with some new goods, but he simply won't do business with me. I truly hate to keep imposing, but would you please try to make him see reason? You do well to bring him a token of goodwill, some sand radishes for you to do. Guess what I have? In true Blue Peter fashion. Here's some I collected earlier. And down we go, down we go. Time to speak to an asshole again. Hello. Ah, uh, the Survey Corps who quelled the Lord of the Hollow. Getting roped into errands on my account. Tell you the truth, I'd be happy to just get my core products out to the shop for free. But that would mean letting Joy off the hook, and the very idea of that sets my teeth gnashing. Are you bound for the Iceland soon? Bring me back free sand radishes. Oh, you're back with the veggies. Well done. Gathering them in a harsh climate. Would you let me have free sand radishes? Sure. There we go. The Albas Iceland's finest feature. If you give these bitter roots a nice for a pickling, it brings out a unique sweetness. Once they're pickled, they make for a lovely, crisp, and well, quite well like snack. My granddaughter makes a fine pickle. I tell you what. Perhaps I'll ask her to give one of these a nice briny soak. Anyway, I'm sorry I keep on using you as a go-between with Joy. I suppose the time I had a proper conversation with the whelp. Yeah, I think I know where this is going. I think. Maybe. Hello. Now listen, I'll set you up some new goods, but as a favour to marry Ash and not you. Don't think for a second this means I've accepted you. But Toha, sir. Oh, please, Grandpa, I can't believe this is still an issue for you. Yui, how long have you been? What? Is our little store not worthy to sell your goods? Talk about letting personal feelings get in the way of your business. If you keep this up, Grandpa, I swear I'll never speak to you again. Grab, but why is what you you swore you'd never get married and leave your poor grams? Who in their right mind makes takes a tiny child's word so seriously? Oh you'd be surprised. I'm so sorry my grandpa has been such a bother to you, Marashna. I hope this doesn't put you off visiting our shop. His greatest treasure is his granddaughter. Well, in any case, we've got excellent new items on our shelves. Go buy some. It's nice to know he treasures his granddaughter that much. Right, I have to go find a woman in the Highlands then. Oh, so I should probably chuck some stuff away. Or put some stuff away, at least. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. 
Yeah, that should be fine for inventory. Mass outbreaks of Croagunk. Okay. Alright, so where would this woman be then? Hey, Saluna, buddy, you're gonna have to help me here. Alright, let's see. Uh, blue? No? No blue? There's an item. Where are you going? No? 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 Yes. No. Yes. There we go. I did all that for mud. Okay. Right, where would she be? No. No blue. No blue. Something. Star piece. Ow. I should probably start from the top. Yeah. Oh, those two are just chilling here. Okay. It is in the Highlands, I need to check, right? Um... Aha! Blue! I saw blue! At last, oh, I knew you'd come to find me. I got hit with a gust from Honchcrow that sent me tumbling down the mountainside. There's a Honchcrow here. I couldn't climb back up, so I couldn't, and I couldn't get down either, so I've been stuck. So, um, please get me back on track. Oh my god, really? Really? You're always around to save me when I need it. If only you were in my core, I'd be much better off. A galaxy teammates, really? It's such a relief to hear you say that. I'm so glad I can rely on you. Aww. It's a little embarrassing, I guess, to admit to myself that I need to rely on you. Oh, you know what? I used to think that Sneasler was a mean Pokemon, but it looks sly, and since it looks sly and savory, but it helped me out of a real tight spot, so I guess it must be good of heart after all. Are you going the right way? Report to Zeke. Well, I guess it's just there. Go, oh, word here. Yep, return to Jubilee. All right, so should I pick up another quest, or should I save that for later? Hmm. Maybe I could have a video be under thirty minutes for once. <laughs> Right, so speak, speak, solve, complete. Alright, I can do these two. Okie dokie. Do you have anything new in stock? No, you would have had a speech bubble. Oh well. Right then, hello. It seems as if there's nothing you can't find. I'm always thanking you, but thanks again. There's simply no doubting your abilities. 
And I heard from Wanda how you reassured her, telling you her your teammates and all. She's even started calling you a savior. It really means a lot to her to be accepted by someone like you. And as a big brother, I appreciate you keeping her safe too, of course. I know she can be a real scatterbrain, so I'm glad she's got you looking out for her. Woo. Now I feel like if I enter, or if I exit and re-enter, there's going to be a quest for the snow fields. Alright. I knew it. <sighs> Tell you what, I have two quests in the snow fields. I will do that next time. <laughs> Okie dokie. So, although I probably should do those. Eh, 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 mm, mm. Sure, why not? <laughs> I feel like since these are request videos, it should just be me completing as many as I can. Right, hello. There's a girl I was hoping for, Wanda's constant saviour, day has finally come, day Wanda even couldn't find a way back from the obsidian field lands. What? Use the send from Raggedy Old hand Handkerchief. Okay. Obsidian field lands? Really? Really? How? Unless she's on a bloody Ramenas Island bit. Huh. That's how it breaks off, Krogunk. Where the balls would she be? Um. Hmm. Hmm. She's gonna be up there, isn't she? I'm surprised she's not at the top. Are you here? Nope. Nope. Not here. Hmm. Oh, I see you. Okay. Eek help, oh please, I don't want to spout mushrooms. Okay. Can I catch these, or am I just... No, I can catch those. Okay. Well, might as well get some points. One down, two to go. Energy ball. That was a crit. Oh, I'm glad I got your stats up. And spore. Drowsy. Okay. Okie dokie. And my boom. Nah. Gonna use a different ball. Alright, slash on ghost. That's nice. Tell you what, I'll use a great ball. And... Nope. Alright, fine, and the bloody ultra ball on you. Ay, ay, ay. I don't really want to waste the ultra balls. Getting iron ore is a pain. All right, one left. Get in the ball and stay in the ball. Thank you. Whoa. Why do I have a Psyduck on my team? 
I think I caught it in the marshlands last time. Father, thank you! I swear I'd never survive here in history without you as a teammate. I came to patrol because I know some of the villagers come out here to hunt for mushrooms. While keeping an eye out for them, I end up hunting around a bit f myself for some finds. But the mushrooms ended up hunting me. I guess my brother's probably a mess worry about me again, huh? But yeah, so good at battling. Probably even better suited to the security corps than I am. Nah, I like exploring. Turn the galaxy hall. Aye, aye. I swear, there's probably going to be one of her in the snowlands. Okay, I guess I have to bloody report. Aye, aye, aye. Money! New observations, most illuminating. Yeah, I caught more of them, so it's an extra level. 20 points. Return to village, hand us in, and then we're done. <laughs> uh huh. I don't suppose there's another quest around here, is there? No. Okie dokie. And we knew. Nope. And talk to you again. Thank you for saving Wanda yet again. So glad we got the survey core to rely on. Chill to my row when I heard my sister was caught up in a Pokemon attack. If only she could just get herself assigned to patrolling in a village. Nice and safe. You wish. Let me guess, if I go back in here, there's going to be one for the snowfields. And... No, they're both gone. Huh. Well, okay then. Hm. Okay, so I think with that, I'm going to end this video here. This has been Dragon of Eternity going through more Pokemon Legends Arceus in... This video, I started going through the long, long list of requests that I need to get through. So, I have five here. And there's another six, at the very least, to pick up from the blackboard. So, next time, I'm going to be working on some of these, hopefully. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So, with our planned out viewers... With my rambling hopefully now finally done. Until next time.